Men's College Basketball Big West Conference, Cal Poly set to tangle with Pacific. Mod Athletic Center first half. In the early going, Mustang point guard Drake Yu gets into the paint. He hits the spin cycle. Yu Yu's shot drops in for two of his six points. He also collected five rebounds in the game. Later, Chris Eversley testing the Tiger defense. Jamal Johnson swings the ball to Reese Morgan. He pulls the trigger and cans the long range jumper, but the well dried up for Cal Poly and the Mustangs could only muster a single basket in the next seven minutes. Pacific capitalized. Ross Rivera hands the ball to Lorenzo McLeod. He drives into the lane and sticks the fadeaway jump shot. The Tigers took a 16-7 lead. Later, McLeod gets into the lane once again. He draws the help defender, then kicks the ball out to the perimeter. Travis Fulton strokes it from behind the arc. The Pacific lead held at nine, but the Mustangs would rally and pull to within a point by intermission. Second half action, Travis Fulton still feeling it. He gets it to Colin Beatty, then spots up in the corner. Beatty finds him and Travis Fulton finds the bottom of the net. He led the Tigers with 19 points. Things would start to break the Mustangs' way, just over 15 minutes left to play. Chris Eversley puts the ball on the floor. He loses the handle but collects the rock and gets it to Brian Bennett underneath the rim. Eight points, 10 rebounds for Bennett. Now 36-28 Tigers with 13 minutes left. Cal Poly makes a run. Drake Yuyu sets up Dylan Royer for three, count it. Royer's only basket of the game. The Mustangs trailed by five. Then Jamal Johnson beats Chris Eversley flashing to the wing. Eversley takes it to the rack and lays it in. Cal Poly cuts the lead to one, 44-43. Seven and a half minutes left. Drake Yuyu back to Eversley on the wing. Chris O'Brien with a nice screen down low. Eversley all alone and he drills the three ball. 21 points, 10 rebounds for Eversley. Cal Poly grabs its first lead since the first half, 46-45, and the Mustangs kept firing. Chris O'Brien to Kyle Ottister, smack. Ottister tallied 14 points in the game, and Mustang fans were on their feet as Cal Poly continued to surge. And down the stretch, the home team closed it out at the free throw line. Chris O'Brien, true from the strike. He led the way with four assists. Cal Poly upends UOP 67-62 the final. Now, we don't have the largest arena in the conference, but <laughs> we definitely like to make something of it. So when it gets loud, that run was huge for us. And a, couple, a lot of guys made key baskets and key rebounds, key box offs. So that was a good stretch for us defensively and offensively. So I was very impressed with that. And I thought we got huge contributions and, and, and spark from those guys off the bench. Um, the critical minutes, critical energy. We've been together for a long time, so everybody started playing together. We weren't focused on so much just running the offense, just playing and playing how the defense plays us and take the shots when it's open. 